quick mask tool here inside Perfect Effects, which can also be found in multiple other modules across the suite, is a wonderful way for you to selectively apply stylings to your images. My original photo, which you can see here, is extremely warm, it has a nice soft background. However, what I'd like to do is add a little bit of coolness, contrast, and depth to the plane in the foreground. On the right hand side of my screen in my filter stack, I've created an adjustment brush layer that does just that. And when I turn it on, you'll see that the plane looks so much better, all those greens and blues really stand out, but the background leaves a little bit to be desired. The Quick Mask tool is a great way to cut out the background in just one stroke. Found on the left hand side of your screen in your tool well, all you need to do to use it is click and drag over the area of your image that you'd like to remove an effect from. As it processes, it'll go through and create an almost perfect mask around your subject. If we take a look at that mask, it's done an amazing job outlining the entire plane. Just in case there are any little areas of the image that you do need to fix up, there are a couple of refinement tools on the left hand side in that same tool well that you can use to clean up the edges. My favorite is called the Refine Brush, which you can find right in the middle. I'll go ahead and select that, and all you need to do to use this one is just click and drag along in an area that you need to clean up. For instance, there's a see-through top of this plane, and right now it's a little too blue. So when I click and drag over that, it's going to refine the edge of the mask for me, and it's going to bring just a little bit of warmth back right there. And when we take a look at the mask again, it's done a great job of creating that very, very light transparency there. As you can see, with the help of the Quick Mask tool, it's going to be a lot easier and faster creating masks here inside Perfect Effects to selectively apply filters to your images.